Kuritea mai rā, te tāurua, te rangi, kia tīnā, kia whēnā, kia toka te mana waura. Tīnā toka te mana waura ki hea, tīnā toka te mana waura ki runga, ki rangi nui e tui honei. Tīnā toka te mana waura ki hea, tīnā toka te mana waura ki raro, ki papatua nuku e takoto nei. Tīnā toka te mana waura ki hea. Tīnā toka te mana waura ki ngā waka, ki ngā reo, ki ngā maunga kōrero o tēnai wi o tēnai wi. Rātau e tāmia nei e te mā wiwi, rātau kua katohia e tira ngā kahawai tuā. Ko i arai rongo whakairi hia ki runga, ki runga hei. Tūturu whakamaua kia tīna, haumi e hui e taiki e. Kā tika rā me mihi ki te kaupapa o tēnei hui huinga e ki nei ko te rangi ki ngitanga. E tika ana kia mihi ki tō tātou ki ngi kia ki ngi tu heitia e noho mai rai tōna hurewa tapu. Te ahurewa i waihotea mai rai tōna whaia o tira i ona mātua tūpuna. Kei te kāhui āriki tūtonu, tūtonu, tūtonu. Kā huri ngā mihi ki a koutou e oku manuhiri. Koutou e oku rangatira, ngā kuru paunamu o huri amarai, ngā kākāri ki pōwhaitere o tauranga moana, mau mai, piki mai, kake mai, whakatau mai rā ki runga ki te whare wānanga waikato, o ti rā whakatau mai rā ki runga ki a mātau o te piringa, e ki nei ko te wāhanga ture, ngā mai, piki mai, kake mai. He miho ki ki a koutou, e oku rangatira, koutou ko tāe mai ki te whakarongo, ki ngā kōrero reka, e pāna ki te kīngitanga, ki te paukai, me ngā kaupapa katoa, ai pāna ki tērā tūnga mana nui. Nō reira, kia tātou katoa, huri noi te whare, kia ora tātou katoa. My name is Apera Hama Hurihanga Nui. I come from Rotorua, Te Arawa. I'm a fifth year law student at Waikato. And I've been given the task of opening today's hui in Matu Tixon's absence, and we wish him all the best in his recovery. So I'd like to extend a warm welcome to our guests from Tauranga Moana, I understand that there is a person in your group who will introduce the speakers in more detail. However, I have a brief profile on each of our speakers. Our first speaker is Mōrehu Ngātoko Rahipere, prominent kaumātu of Ngāti Ranginui, also of Ngāi Tamarāwaho, Tauranga Moana, Huri Amarai, father and koro to 11 children, Mokopuna Tuatahi, Tuarua and Tuatoru, kei te koro tēnei kāmihi. Our second speaker is Mere Fuiya Bennett, prominent kaumātu a kui of Ngāti Ranginui iwi, Ngāti Tamarāwaho Hapū, Tauranga Moana, Huri Amarai, mother to four children, four mokapuna and five mokapuna tuarua, kei te kuia tēnei kāmihi. Our third speaker is Charlie Dahiri, CEO of Te Piringa National Collective of Māori Providers, registered member of Ngāi Tamarāwaho me Ngāti Kau Hapū, ringawera of Ngā Marae Paukai, father to three children, kei te pāpā tēnei kāmihi. Our fourth speaker is Sylvia Hemuata Willison, Registered member of Ngai Tamarawaho and Ngai Tama Whariua, Ringawera of Ngā Marae Paukai, Chairman of the Marae Committee, Executive Officer of Huria Trust, Kai Whakahaere mo te hapu o Ngai Tamarawaho, Mother to Five Children, Nain Mokopuna, a tēnei kei te mihi. We also have a number of members who are accompanying our guests today. We have two kuia, Māora Ngā Toko Reid and Makiroa Tu Kaukau, e oku manuariki, tēnei kā mihi. And we have three pakeke, Teresa Nepia, Jamie Jack Kino and Kirsty Willison, a tēnei te mihi nui ki a koutou katoa. Without further ado, I'd like to introduce the topic of our discussion today. It is Kingi Tanga e Paukai in Tauranga Moana, a presentation by tribal members of Ngai Tamarawa ho Tauranga, the beginnings of the Paukai held at Huri Amarai in April each year, and their connections to the Kingi Tanga. Ngo reira e o kuranga tira, kea koutou te wā tēnei kāhu. Kia ora tātou katoa. Kia ora tātou. I karangatia ki a hara mai. Tēnei kāinga o te rā. Ke tātou tātou ki ingi a tūheitia. A tuatahi, ko mau au taku mau. Ko tauranga te moana, ko ngāti rangi nui te. Nō reire kuranga tira, tātou hā kui kuia, tēnā koutou, a tēnā koutou, 
Nā Ori 
tamarik a otira ya mata wano inga pakek tuata no reira nga whakahaere iru ngai tō mātau mara e pāna ki te hapu e kaweana i ngā huatanga katoa iru ngai tō mātau mara o ngā komiti o whakatūria ai whakahaere tēnā kaupapa i tēnā kaupapa i tēnā kaupapa ko i nei rā ngā whakahaere i roto i tō mātau mara a tainoa mai ki te kingita o te kingita ngā e tino kaupapa e tauana ki a mata penei nā ko maharai a winiata tō mātau kura i tīmata mai te whale wāna ngā waikata a i tīmata mai a nga mahi reira te whaka mō heotia e maharaia ko wai a ia, ko ai tōna hapu, ko ai tōna iwi. A kātau ki roto i te hina ngalo o ngā mea e kōro te atu ana e ia. Nō te roanga, ka mate tō mātau klau a maharaia. E hanga tamariki tonu ana a maharaia ka mate. Ka mahua mai mātau te hunga kuare. Tērā tū momo kōrero, te mea koia. Ia ia ngā mātau ranga katoa. Ngā mātau. Ia maharai. Te ngaro tanga tu a maharai. Ka huara pira pihara mātau. A koai, koai, koai. Ai pakatū i tōna tūranga. E kore tonu i kite he tangatai. A hoi anō, koina tēnei, karapu rapu hāra māta. Me te mōhio anō, ki te āhua, o ngā mara e maha, i roto i a ngāti rangiru. Me te piri rākau tērā. Ko hairini tērā. Ko huria tērā. A ka whakaaro tia kia rāhui mātau. Hai aha hai pai ngā nō. Mō mātau tupuranga ngā mokopuna. E tupu a kia. A ha kua kāre a mōhio an. E ngari. E taima. Hai whaka mōhio atu ki o tātou tamariki tupurangu. A koe i rātou. Hea te tika ngā o tērā. O te hapu karanga e karanga tia nei. Nō reira kā mahi a mātou mahi. Ka tiro tiro. Whaka waho. Pe hea na te whaka haere o etehi o ngā marae o ngāti rangi nui. A me ngāti pūkenga anoho. Ngā ti pūkenga i wainga nui a mata. Hoi anō ka kitea, te huarahi, e hāpai ake ai i te mana. O tēnā hapu, o tēnā hapu, o tēnā hapu i wainga nui a mata. A kā tīmata ngā mahi, whakāko ki te kōrero, Whakāko, ko ai rātau, ko ai tēnā hapū, ko ai tēnā hapū, ko ai tēnā hapū. A i tōna mutunga, ka tūtuki ngā whakāro. A hakoa, i āhua takaroa te haere. I te mea, ko te nuinga o ngā kaumātua, ko ngaro atu. Ko ia nō ka taia e mātā. Tōna mutunga o tēnā marae, o tēnā marae, o tēnā marae. 
tarahui mai mātau ngā marae ko ngā tiranginu. Ah, mai te rā wā ki tēnei wā e hare ko tahi ana mātau. E ono pea ngā e nui noa tūrāne, fitu pea ngā marae i raro i te mana o ngā tiranginu. Ah, kā mutu tērā, tiro atu ki tō mātau maunga o mau ao, Koi rā, te hua mō mātau, e whakapiripiri ai a mātau ki a mātau. Nō reira, koi rā, e pēnā ana i tēnei tū rangi, tōni. Ko mau au te mau, ko tauranga te moa, ko ngā tirangi nui tēhi. Kei koi reira anō, e te hi o mātau, ngā ngai te rangi. Kei taura, anā kā hui anō, anā i te rangi, ki a rātau, anā, ka whakatau i ngā kaupapa e pāna ki a rātau. A i tēnei rangi i tonu, e hare ko tahi ana mātau, ngā i te rangi, ngā ti rangi nui, me ngā ti pūkeni. A koi rā ngā, ngā hapū, karanga, Kai roto i te mōno taura. E hare ko tahi ana mātau. Me ana e āwanga wanga ana. Kai roto i tēnā i tēnā. Nā ko warahu i mātau. Ko hui ki te whakatika. Me ana ko wai rānei e hea. Engari kāra i te he. Engari hoi anō. Hai whakatika tika i ngā hua tanga katoa. I wainga nui a mātau i te moana o tauranga. I te moana o tauranga. Nō reira, poi nei te āhua tanga e pāna ki a mātau. E hāre ko tahi ana mātau. E tau te ko ana mātau i tēnā hapu, i tēnā hapu, i tēnā hapu. I raro i te mana o tō mātau waka, o takitā. Pera anō, a ngā i te rangi. E kawea na i a rātau, i raro tō rātau nei waka o mā tātua. Engari, ka pā mai ki ngā kaupapa nui o te mōna o taurangi, o rāhu i katoa mātau, o whakakotahi mātau i a mātau. Nō reira, kā nui te reka o te hare, tahi, o ngā hapu kalanga i te mōna o taurangi. Kā rehe a wanga wanga. Engari, Ko te kotahi, he mea, he kaupapa tā ngā i te rangi, ana, kua kōrerotia i wanga nui a rātau, a, te ura wāke, a kua rongo mātau, wa hale mai e te hi o rātau pūka i kōrero, ai kōrero i ngā take, he pāna ki a rātau. Ana, whaka kotahi tia e mātau katoa. Nō reira, ko e ira, te reka, o te noho tahi, me ki o ngā taina, me ngā tuakana, i roto i te moana o tauranga. Pai ana te te noho tai. Pai ana te hare ki te tautoko, a hakoa heaha ngā kaupapa i tēnā marae, i tēnā marae, i tēnā marae. Nō reira koe nei, ngā huatanga e pāna ki a mātā. E te hi e tai mano, a i wainga nu, wainga no i a mātā. Ia ngai tama rā waho, ngā nawe nawe, e ka puta mai. O i anō ka tūake, e tehi o mātau ngā kau mātua ki te whakatika i ngā whakālo. O ngā meki, ngā mea kuare ana ki ngā tikanga e pāna ki tō rātau hapu ki a ngai tama rā waho, ki a ngā tirangi. Nō reira, e pai ana te haere o taku hapu, E pai ana te haere o tō mātau iwi. E pai ana te haere o tēnā marae, o tēnā marae i rota i te moana o tauranga. Ko tahi ana ngā whakāra. Nō reira koe nei i rā, ngā huatanga katoa e pāna ki a mātau, ki a ngā tirangi nui, ki a ngā ti pūkenga, me ngā i te rā. Nō reira, e a kuranga tira, Anō ka mihi atu ki a kotoa, ki a tātou katoa, 
ki a tātou kato he e, e whakaoro nui tēnei, te whakarāhui a tātou. E mua i te aro aro tō tātou ki ngia kūheitia. Ah, e, e pai ana, e, e, e o rāna te ngākau, te ki te aki a kotou katoa e kūrangatira. Ah, mua tāi mai nei, ki rote i tēnei o tātou whare. Hoi anō hai whakautu te kōrero, hai whakamohi o kōrero ki a kotou kai hea mātou a Ngāti Ranginui ah, me o mātou ah, kai hana ah, Ngāti Pūke nga te tērā ah. Nā, kai 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 te pai te hāre o mātou i tō mātou nga ah, me hea hea pa, patapatai ana ki kai a kotou ah, patapatai ngema あ、今日の会会会とはこんばんは、手前がこちらが手前な、こんにちらに抜いて、いい、こたきちみてわかこがいたまらわほてはっぺ、こふりやてまらい、こたまてやぽかいふにはあ、とくちぷな、あ、
we did some research and pulled together this booklet, Te Mahuri Tanga o Te Paukai. And this was to celebrate 50 years of Paukai at Huri Marae. And in here, I've just taken comments from this booklet to share with you. But we have a number of these books, and we brought a few there, not, not to go around by the looks of things to everyone. But, um, you know, we've got some at home, and if you're interested in accessing any of these books, um, just let us know. But inside the book, it gives you more detail in terms of what we're trying to share with you today. <clears throat> um, the whakapapa itself, uh, for the king to go out on a limb for Ngai Te Marawaho, the whaka, whakapapa records, records would have been double-checked and the king's sponsorship and presence carefully managed. Now, that's noted in our book because that came out of the original, uh, this booklet here. Mm. Uh, which was uh, used uh, on that first day, uh, for that celebration of the first pokai back in um, 1958. And then there's a little, there, a little bit more there. The whakapapa inside, just to reinforce, the whakapapa inside the door. What you see here on the, on the side there is the whakapapa. And that whakapapa sits within inside the Wharetupuna Tamatea to the right as you come inside the meeting house. Um, and that gives you the connection, if you like, in terms of our connection as a hapu, as a iwi, back to the, through to the kingitanga. Uh, the whakapapa, which had a place of honour, was directly linked to the king. This legitimised the identity of the hapu in the eyes of the motu, on my errors, and includes Te Atai Rangi Kahu. Now that was the kōrero from Francis Winiata, Maharaya's wife. Getting on to the relationship, Princess Tapuya strengthened Ngai Tamarawaho link through Maharaya, who supported her work within Waikato during the dark years of Raupatu and despair. Te Puya's vision for her Waikato iwi was a template for Ngai Tamarauho to also rise again like the phoenix from the ashes of despondency. As we all know, Raupatu has been a... Uh, what's the word? It has been a taumaha. It has been tapu. It has been stressful. It has been, you know, so many things to our people in terms of what has come from Raupatu. And uh, back in those days, Raupatu certainly was prominent in terms of the land wars and in terms of the confiscation of our lands. Even though uh, for Ngai Tamarawaho, our land mass or loss wasn't as great as Waikato, the impacts and, um, you know, everything that came with that land loss was pretty much the same that we all felt right across the country. Um, okay. The Pokai is an institution of the King Movement. It is an occasion when the tribes gather to offer their loyal affection to the King a central feature is the kaihākari, which in itself is an expression of feelings of generosity, friendliness, hospitality towards the least privileged, <coughs> ideals basic to the King Movement. Now I just want to cut off into there and um, talk a little bit about the planning and the preparation that goes into the actual pokai itself. I'm, um, I'm Probably in my life, I won't tell you fully how old I am, but all of my life I probably only missed maybe a couple of pokai. But as a child growing up with my parents, I was witness, all of my siblings, we were witness to what uh, the loyalty that our parents had for the pokai, um, the love they had for the pokai, for the kingitanga, just the privilege and honour of being able to host Tainui, the Kingitanga, and I grew up in that era, and I came to love it too, and I consider it to be 
just that one day in the year, a labour of love. And I say that to my children, and I say that to my mokopuna, because it must go on through the generations. And so for my whānau, and for many of our whānau, of Ngai Tamarawaho, that's the tradition. And in order to continue that tradition, we must maintain and sustain our belief, our support for the Kingitanga, and for just through the hosting of our pokai helps us to just keep that relationship strong. Now, I also have the role of the uh, Women's Committee uh, chairperson. We run the marae, basically. And, uh, yeah, woman, woman. Uh, I don't know what happened to our men. Maybe we got too smart, I don't know, or, or too good at what we were doing and, you know. But anyway, hui and all. I'd just like to say that just for a bit of a cutter. Um, our Women's Committee um, run the pokai and probably about two months out every year we start to plan for the pokai. And it's a huge mahi because we need to consider um, where we're going to get funding from. We need to consider, and this is a parallel, I'll go back to the old days, but how we do it nowadays, it's pretty much we look at koha, we put out to our whanau an invitation to support the pokai by way of a koha, and then from there we set the menus in, in progress, and um, just over the last two, maybe three years, Charlie, We've kind of changed things a little in terms of in terms of our menu. We uh, we have got some really good chefs, and so we decided we'll give the king's table a different menu from everybody else. Whether that's right or wrong, but we love doing that anyway. But the first time we did that, and the comment that came from uh, King Tuhaitia was uh, he referred to our our dining room as the what? <laughs> Uh? The Hulia. So we obviously made an impression on him, but the idea was to test ourselves in terms of what we could do and just see if it would, um, you know, um, be something that we could carry through over time. And so once they put the stake in the ground to do things like that, I'm referring to our chefs, then I've said to them, you've got to carry that on now, mate. You can't stop. So therein lies the challenge for all our new chefs. Um, but yeah, um, you know, planning goes goes out there six two uh, two months prior. We have meetings. Uh, the marae that comes on board with us every year is Tutaranga, Tutaranga or Pirirako uh, marae. Um, they always come on board with us and vice versa. They, can, um, they can't always make it because it clashes with the huiaranga, but they're always there to support us, which is really important for our people and our next generation coming through to remember those sorts of things. They support us by way of koha through poaka, offering up some, uh, a couple of pigs for us to be able to use um, for the kaihākari. And so we really appreciate that, but it's a bringing together of you know, the hapu, the whānau, to um, just support the day. Um, and it shows how important the pokai is to them also, as well as the kingitanga itself. Um, going back, in terms of that parallel, how we do things now is maybe the dollar value. We ask for that koha. But in the days of old, you know, our people... Our people used to, I'm just going to push it back, um, there you go. I've got little comments here that come out of the book again. Um, puka, Puka Nepia, you all know Puka, he's one of our whānau too. Maharaya asked him to be in charge of playing movies and various marae in the moana to raise funds by pigs for the pokai. Another comment from Hape Kuka, uh, without needing to prompt people, People readily gave forth with their preserves, their pickles, their chow chow and vegetables of all kinds, their beef, their pork and their mutton, and also um, appeared. They also turned up. 
This kōrero is prevalent throughout marae around the motu and for huia, more so when the pokai came around. And that was Auntie Hapi's uh, kōrero. Um, Nanny Hapi has gone on now. Um, and then I just, yeah, finish with that, that little uh, whakatauki at the bottom. Mātō uh, roro, mātō kūroro. And that's so befitting of how our people really worked hard in the days, in Dad's days, and Nanny's days, you know, to mahi the kai, to make sure that our pokai was supported, our tainui, our visit, uh, visitors, our manuhiri were fed well, and um, there was the commitment and the love and the honour that they had for the pokai and for the kingitanga. Okay, I'm, I'm going to ask Mary Fewer if she'd like to stand up and um, have a little bit of a... Yeah, I'm going to O kuranga tira e noho mai nga ki ta whakarongo ki a mātou e kōrero atu nei ki a kōtou o te paukai. Hoi ono ka huri a hau ki te reo hoko prawa, ki te whakatau i atu kōrero. He tino poto poto rawātu. Nā te mea, tērei kuia i māre nga hau i te tau 1952, and by 1958, I had had three children. So my alliance, as far as I was concerned, was to my children and to my whanau. So uh, <clears throat> I would go down to my marae, ietehe tau, to what we would normally call today, to check at what the pokai was about. Because <laughs> those days, the pokai was held over the weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So uh, it was quite a busy time for my people, but as I admit, I never had much to do with it. For you know, <clears throat> my husband died in 1958. So, and while living at his hapu of uh, Ngāti Hangarau, I started, or oh, after he died in 19... 95 was when he died, sorry. And uh, I started to become involved with things on the marae at Ngāti Hangarau. So eventually I became the kuia kalanga of that marae. And as it says here, uh, after he had died, I became more involved uh, with things on the marae. And it's most especially when the Waitangi Tribunal sittings began in Huria, because I have to admit, I didn't know all the stories about my marae of Huria. So I went back and <coughs> submitted a submission, and that was where I learned all the troubles, all the trials, and all the jumping up and down that my kui and Kuroa did prior to my knowing what had been going on at Ngaitamara Waho. And of course, what happened to us as a, a hapu uh, with the lands, and that the land had been given or put under the umbrella of the Kingitanga movement to keep it safe for what we had of our hapu of Ngai Tamarawaho. So, um, <clears throat> and eventually, I have to admit also that once and for all, what made me really go back to my marae was for the rebuilding of the second Tamatea Pokai Whenua, which now stands on our marae, and he's beautiful. So that was what took me back there, and I became really, really involved with my marae. That I was the Kuya Karanga, and I still am. If they still have me, I'm getting a bit old, but however, I made it my job that I would hopefully try and fulfill 
what I had done for my hapu uh, that I hadn't prior to that time. <coughs> Um, well, I did attend the 40th anniversary there, but I can't remember too much about it. But I can tell you, the 50th anniversary was fantastic. It was a wonderful uh, celebration by my hapu, by my marae. And it was held over the weekend, more or less. And even King Tuhaitia and his partner stayed over the weekend. And I think we had a wonderful time to celebrate the fact that, yes, we do hold uh, <clears throat> the, um, the pokai as our marae. And I can say, now that I have been really involved with it, I'm really proud to say I am most grateful for the fact that we do hold the pokai at night. Tamarawaho at Huria Marae. And Maharaja must have known something when he really did ask that we have the pokai at Huria. Because I can see now it has benefited us more than we can say under the umbrella of the king of Tainui. And it wasn't only him, it was towards the end of the reign of um, Atkinui Tataragi Kahu, and I'll always be grateful to know that she used to sleep at Huria when it was held the weekends. It was no problem for her to sleep at the Marae and not go and sleep at the motels like we like to say we want to now. <laughs> I'm saying that rather quietly, but um, <clears throat> no, it was fantastic. It, I have to say, I admired her, and of course I admiring him, and I'm asking the Lord that he look after him and keep him there to reign for us. But yes, as I say, Maharaja must have known something when he asked Koroki that we have the pokai at Huria, because Huria has benefited greatly from that association with the King Ikatanga through the pokai movement, and um, we're proud to say, well, I am, that we do have the pokai at Huria. It's fantastic, it's wonderful. And it brings the people together under the umbrella of the King Tanga movement. And as I say here, my last paragraph, Huria Marae, ai tamarawa ho hapu, nga tiranginui iwi o the wakataki timu has grown in stature. However late it was for me, <coughs> Thank you to the late Tearikinui Tearikinui Kahu for during her reign, my connections with the King Tearikinui grew and strengthened. And I am hoping that our Rangatai will carry that on forever and a day. Tēnā koutou, mō tāko te whakaroho mai ki tēnē kuia. Just picking up on a couple of things, when we had the 40th anniversary of the Pokai, when we realised it was 40 years, uh, we had a little bit of a celebration. It was just a you know, quite happy, happy celebration. And Te Atai Rangikahu um, actually turned up to be a part of that with us and we had a whakangaho going in the marquee on the marae. So that was something really special again that we experienced with um, Te Atai Rangikahu. Um, <coughs> shall I ask, uh, are there any questions that people might want to ask at this stage? <coughs> Ka <Kabai. laughs> I'll ask uh, Maura to come up, one of our other queer, to come up and um, have a say. Nā mihi ki a koutou katoa. Uh, a <laughs> 
e pāna ki te kōrero a tā māta ataku kasunga e noho mai nei. Kōrero ana ki ngā, ngā kohi, uh, ngā, ngā pūtea o te kāinga, uh, ngā koha mō ngā kai, uh, ka haria mai e, e tērā iwi o tērā hapu ki te kāinga, hei tautoko, hei whāngai i a tātou manuhi. E pai tērā, ko te āhua tērā o te paukei, koe rataku whakāro. A, ko te āhua hoki o te a, whakawhanaunga ta, a, tanga, o te tangata ki te tangata, te hapu ki te hapu, ko te iwi ki te iwi. Koe rataku whakāro. A, I te wā, i tīmata mai ngā te paukei i te kāinga, e kaho e haere ki a nau i tā wai, a, i, i a, ahuriri, i te waipau namu, a kāre tonu au i, I tae atu ki te kāinga, ki te marae, mō te a, paukai tuatahi, tuatua, tuarua pea. E ngari ka hoki waku maka, mahara ki a te wā, i te whakatūwhera tanga o tā mātou a, a, a tūpunu wharei a tamate pō kai whenua. I reira hau. A, Te rāua, I think ko te tuatoru pea uh, o te paukai e, e ta, noho tahi ana i te taha o tamate a pūkai whenua te whakatū whera tanga. I ka tērā, mm-hmm. um, uh, i reira, koe ra te taku āroha ke, e whakāroa nau ki tō tātou ranga, ki tā mātou ranga tira. Um, <laughs> a taku whakāro ki tā mātou uh, rangatira ki a maharaia, nā te mea koera te wā te tau i mate mai e i ohore re tana mate i te kāinga. Ai tērā wā hoki, uh, ka mau maharāno ki taku pāpa, me taku whaea, ana ko te tuakana o tā tātou kraua nei, uh, I, I te hohi pera rāua, nā te mea tētahi o nā mokopuna i reira e, e māwewi ana. Uh, a kā reo i tino mōhio mena i tai mai rāua ki te tangihanga o tā mātau rangatira. Kuera taku, uh, taku āroha ki tērā, tērā wāhanga. Engari, Ai, e tika tērā tā te kōrero āwaku hoa, um, e tino mīharo uh, te, te paukai te kāinga, e tahi atu uh, take hoki te kāinga, nā te mea anō, ko te whakawhanaunga tanga, ko te mihi atu ki era o tātou kāre anō tātou i tūtaki, a uh, ko te mihi anō ki era e mōhio nga tātou, engari ka puta mai ki te marae. Uh, me mutu pea ki konei, ai te rā. Uh, anō te mihi ki a tōi, ki a koutou katoa, ana, e nga tātou katoa. Um, it's it's sometimes helpful when you um, get other people to come up and have a kōrero because in between it all I start to remember other things that are really important and I want to share this one with you and it was when one one after one of the pokai uh, when we were saying our farewells I had a quiet little discussion with Teata because at that time a tunnel came in from another marae to host the pokai a marae from Huria, and this was the first time we started to, not from Huria, from Tauranga. This was the first time we were actually kind of challenged for our place with hosting the pokai. And cause Ngai Tamarawa, who are very, very, you know, um, what's the word? <laughs> Obsessive, protective <laughs> of the pokai, and that's something that's developed over the years in terms of the re- relationships we've had. And anyway, I remember having this conversation with Atta after the tunnel had gone down on the on the Marae Atia. 
before she left. And I said to her, what do you, what do you think of that, um, Te Ata? And she said to me, I think it's wonderful. I think it's wonderful if you can spread it and share the pokai with as many people in marae as possible. So you know that's something that my people have to remember too. I think we're all on the same waka, but you know, if there was a process, it would be, okay, you can have it next year, but it comes back to us every other year, that type of process. And, and I'm sure we'd be comfortable with that. But hoia no, I'm going to ask Charlie as our last speaker. Tēnei kā mihi atu kia, kia, uh, kia koutou, kia tātou anō hoki ko a karahui hui mai i rui te, te kaupapa whakahirahira. Tuatahi mai mākoe mihi atu ki tō tātou nei uh, kia pau, nā nei whakatūwhera tō tātou nei um, rā uh, i te atane. Uh, e tūtou toko anau ngā mihi ki tō tātou nei kēngi, uh, me ngā pāhara keke o te kā hui ariki. Uh, kia koe e te tūmua ki tēnei kā mihi atu kia koe, uh, kia tūpau taku mahunga i mui a koe i tēnei, I tēnei rā. Ngā māra i kura, ngā mōrehu kuia, uh, tēnā koutou katoa, uh, koko hinau, uh, ngā te awa, tēnā koutou, uh, te whakahiapo, ngō tō koutou nei manaakitanga, kia mātau i tēnei ata, uh, kia ūkoutou ki tēnei kaupapa o te paukai, uh, kia nei ko te manaakitanga, nō reira tēnā koutou katoa, o tira te tari o te piringa, uh, tēnā koutou. Tangata ako ana i te whare, te tūranga ki te marae tauana, a person who is taught at home will stand collected on the marae. A child who is given proper values at home and cherished within the family will not only will not only behave well amongst the family, but also within society and throughout their life. A quote that was penned by a great leader, Princess Te Puya Herangi, as she went about her role to establish Tūrana Waiwai Marae and Ngaru Wahia as a place for her people, in fact all Māori, to stand. Te Puya had a vision that the marae should be a sanctuary Mo te pani, te pauwaru, me te rawakore, the sick, the bereaved and the, the destitute. The marae is our place to stand, it is where we afford the utmost respect to our elders and where we bestow upon our manuhiri uh, a welcome befitting of royalty. This was her legacy and one that, it, that continues to be practised on marae throughout Aotearoa and certainly on our marae in Huria, uh, at Huria in Tauranga. As you've heard, we've been up, upholding po holding pokai on our marae for over 50 years, and it's become an institution for not, not only Ngai Tamarawo, but Ngāti Ranginui and Tauranga Moana. He kai kei akurina. There is food at the end of my hands. This is said by a person who can use their limited means and resources and basic and more than not hereditary learned abilities that, uh, to create success through feeding the multitudes. That is what a marae is all about. That is the foundation of pokai. It is important that we acknowledge the beginnings of our, our connection with the Kingitanga. Whilst the land wars of the 1850s and 60s saw Uri from Tauranga fight alongside Waikato and Uri from Waikato fight alongside us at Pukehinehine in Teranga, the nucleus of pokai in Tauranga Moana started in the time of King Tafio. He travelled to Tauranga during the flu epidemic in the 1800s with a view to lifting the tapu that the epidemic had laid upon our people, especially our children. He visited a place we now call te, we call te Waro, to perform a ritual. Te Waro is an ancient burial ground where ancient rituals of burial were performed. During these rituals, it is said the concept of the care for the pani, te pauwaru me te rawakore, were first spoken by Tafia. Rua whenua ki waikato, rua moana ki tauranga. A quote I heard while, whilst recently in Waikato, which refers to the similarities we share in terms of symptomatic effects of Raupatu, for which Sylvia had touched on earlier. We were a, a destitute people, landless, penniless and homeless, and we were being pressured to become pseudo-assimilated Pākehā. One thing we possessed was our soul and our dignity. We were still an honourable people, and we still are an honourable people, in the time of Maharaya Winiata, our people found a reason to be proud. Whilst he acknowledged the ill health of our people and high incidence of death amongst our whanau, he set, on on a, set out on a path to revive us. He did this through his extremely close relationships with Te Puya, with whom he taught to read English. And then he worked hard to teach Kuruki to speak English. 
Maharaya was instrumental in reconnecting the Kingitanga to Ngaita Marauho through our links to Te Wakatakitimu, as you've heard. In doing so, he renamed our Tupuna Whare from Te Kapunga back four generations to Tamate Apukai Whenua, giving us a direct link to the Kingitanga and entrenching us in this, in this the sense of belonging and pride and unity as Ngaita Marauho and Waira to Ngāti Ranginui. This was further cemented in the naming of the son of the late Te Araki Nui Te Atau Rangikahu Maharaya and in the naming of the daughter of the late Maharaya Winiata Te Puya, who, by the way, always plays a pivotal role at the Pokai at Hūria. For years following the renaming of Tamati Apokai Whenua, you would never see, read or hear about Ngāti Ranginui as we were written out of history and epitomises our whakatauki, one of our whakatauki, i te ngaro, i te ngaro ranginui, kakitea, kakitea, kakitea. This was a consequence of our stand at Pukahinehina and Te Ranga and our stand with Waikato in many of the other battles. But that's a whole other lecture. So what does the pokai mean to me as a rangatahi? He tangata takahi manuhiri, he marae puehu. A person who mistreats his guest has a dusty marae. Someone who disregards his visitors will soon find he has no visitors at all. This accentuates the, the importance of manakitanga, or hospitality, within our marae and Māori society, and our culture on the marae. Manakitanga is what the marae is all about, and manakitanga is certainly what pokai is all about. Growing up on the marae, you learn from a very young age the essentials of a marae kitchen, and what tikanga and kawa is, and what the difference between them is. We are often told of the old stories, as Koro and our kui have alluded to today, Stories of the pokai of old where kai was shared and everyone pitched in. We had no budget, but you made it work. Te pokai, te punakai, te anga karaka, te anga kaura, kei kitea te marae. The shells of the karaka berry and the shells of the crayfish should never be seen from the marae. Clearly a reference with a hygienic tone, uh, but something that reminds us that we must be regimented in our kitchen in order to provide the best possible kai and manakitanga. In, in the old days, um, they used to allocate each whānau a role, like your role is to set the tables, your role is to do the kaimwana, your role is to do the meat, your role is to do this. And it got really competitive in the kitchen, um, really competitive between the whānau. And that was probably a good thing because they used to try and outspend each other too, to see who could uh, provide the best things. We, know, we all know that the marae kitchen can be a stressful place, but we also know it's where the, most of the fun happens. It's the heart of the marae and where everyone earns their stripes. Each pokai marae has a signature dish and ours is no different. In the old days, kai was brought in from different marae and pāmu from within our hapuri. Our old people talk of truckloads of melons arriving uh, for pokai along with meat and seafood. We did it the same way for years, providing about 50 different options on pokai day for manuhiri. And as Sylvia said, probably about four or five, maybe six years ago, we sat down to review the kai we served with a view to becoming more healthy and providing healthier options. We had to really ask ourselves how do we maintain the legacy of Maharaya who strive for better health and well-being for our people, thus epitomising his whakatauki, ina arua te oranga ki ngā mea pai, ka rere te wairua, ka taia ngā mea katoa. When our lives and hearts are attuned to good things, life is clear, the spirit flows freely, all is possible. So we changed. We decided on a healthy menu. We were ostracised by the old guard for cutting, out, cutting the fat off the meat um, and removing some kai from the menu. Um, and all throughout, you know, there was about four of us who decided on this. All throughout, we, we were asking ourselves, did we do the right thing? Have we done the right thing? Because at the end of the day, the, marae, the mana of the marae is at, is at stake. Um, so we revamped it. And suffice to say, we've, we received a pretty good compliment from the king. The only problem is that now we have to maintain it or lift the bar. I'm only an ingupe when it comes to pokai, and I stand here with the explicit knowledge that there are people sitting beside me who have dedicated their lives to maintaining and sustaining the institution that is pokai. We will always hold fast to the importance of pokai, which for us is, is to reaffirm our strong links to Kingi Tu Heitia. The Kingi Tanga, Waikato Fanui. And to also remember the Kopapa, Mote Pani, Te Pauwaru, Mete Rawakuri. For me, the Kingi Tanga is more relevant today than it has ever been. 
The statue of Maharaya on Hulia is a constant and ever-present reminder of, to us at home of the struggle and importance of our relationship with Waikato. Hulia is not alone with Pokai. We're part of a huge cycle of Pokai, as you're well aware. Our struggles and achievements are not unique to us. I'd say it happens at every Pokai Marae. And the struggle is important. It's important because it reminds us that everything we have and everything we accomplish is the result of the struggles of those before us. We are comfortable. When we are comfortable, we, we become complacent. And there's no room for complacency when we host the king, or the kingitanga, or waikato, in fact. <clears throat> we live in interesting times and contest interesting ideals. But those of us who know, who were brought up around the struggle of everyday marae life, who lived amongst our whānau, who were destitute, bereaved and poor, we will always remember and maintain this important kaupapa. Mo te kingitanga, mo te pani, mo te pauwaru, me te rawakore. Tangata akuana i te whare, te tūranga ki te marae, tauana. Nō reira, kwa mutu aku kore do a i runga i tēnei whakatau ki nā, nā te pui a herangi. I te ohunga ki i taku moi moi a ki te pua waitanga o te whakaru. I awake from my dreams to the realisation of my desires. Nō reira, hoki wairua mai rā e koro maharaya kei wainga nui a tātou. A nei o uri e tū, ki te hapai tēnei kaupapa, uh, tēnei kaupapa tino whakahira hira ki a mātou o ngai tamarawa ho o tira o tauranga moana. Uh, nō reira, mi tēnei anō ki a pūtau e o ku ranga tira. Uh, Kare tiro aku kore o e kumia, a ko ki te tū, ki te mihi atu ki a pūtau, nō mātou o tō tātou nei marae o huria, o ngai ngā tirangi nui, uh, tēnā koutou katoa, ka hoa tio au te rākau kōrero uh, ki tō tātou nei kraua. Hei whakakapu. Kia ora, Charlie. Uh, kia ora, tātou. As you have heard, um, we're very, very much dedicated to the kaupapa of what we're doing today and, and what we will be doing in the past and the supporting Tainui's kaupapa and supporting one another. So I want to thank each and every one of you for being attentive listeners. Uh, this is what uh, our kaupapa is all about our kaupapa and your kaupapa. Ke pai te haere no ngā paukai a kua kai here. We've never missed one from uh, one of Tainui's we haven't missed yet. We don't intend to intend to support uh, Tainui as well as they've also supported us. So e mihi a tūna ke a koutou i haere mai nei ki te whakalonga ki ngā kaupapa kōrero e pāna ki te paukai, e pāna ki a tātou katoa. Nō reira, i aku rangatira, i aku tua hine, ki a koutou katoa, ko tatu mai nei, nga mihi whānui ki a koutou, tēnā koutou, a tēnā koutou, a kia ora tātou katoa. E hi katu a ke ki runga ra fi te ki taua hei.
koto ai faka kapita tata hui te te kara ki faka mutu oh vai 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 to tata ka kapia ke a te nei ka tua ke a ki te mihi atu ki a koto mai ta marawa ho a te nei te mihi ki a koto ko mai ara ki te toha toha i o koto korero korero hitori korero ma tauranga korero wa ta hu hai faka reka reka i ngataringa a o te hunga ino mai ne a kore mutu ma ka mihi ki a koto a nei tahi taunga uh, mai a mātou te whare wānanga waikato hei whakātu ake i tō mātou aroha nui ki a koutou hei tēnei atau Ahoi anō hei whakakapi tā tātou kaupapa. I kaupapa tā hua. Hari i te kōta ngā kau ki te atu a kōtou katoa ko tatu mai nei roto i tēnei whare, ala anō e te hika e, e rā whare. E tino nui i tātou ko tatu mai ki te whakalongo ki ngā kōrero i ngā hua tanga katoa. Nō rei rei mihi atuana. E mihi atuana ki a kōtou katoa a, mō kōtou e whakalongo mai nei e ngā kaupapa e pāna a, ki tā tātou taonga a, ki ngā huatanga katoa e pāna a, i tō tātou kīngi ki atu heitia nō reira ki a ino i tātou e pā e tōa mātou matu i tarangi te kua tuna mātou i a mātou whakawhetai ki a koe te atāhua O ngā whakahaere o te kaupapa mai te tīmatanga tāno mai ki tēnei wā. Nō reira ka inoe te kia koe ki a mana ki tia mai, te tangata whenua, o lātou mahi e hāngai i ngā manuhiri kua tau nei, hāngai rai a mātā. O tira, ai hāngai anō i roto i a mātā, I o mātou hine ngaro e kore i e ware ware ki ngā huatanga katoa Hea te pūtake o te kaupapa o te paukai Nō reira koe nei rā te inoi atu ki a koe e pā Ke whakatongia mai ki roto i o mātou hine ngaro I o mātou wairua Ngā huatanga katoa e pāna ki te kaupapa Te kaupapa a tō tātou ki ngi te paukai I runga i te ingo o te matua o te tama o te wairua tapu Aia nei a, ake nei, āme nei. Kia ora tātā.